Hi guys, and welcome back. Oh my, I don't even know where to really start, what to go over, what to catch y'all up on. There's a lot. I really cannot be the only one that feels like so much can happen in just a few months. And I have so much to tell you guys, catch you up on all the things. I guess the first big change is that your girl is engaged. Like, what? I'm engaged? Oh my gosh, y'all, I'm engaged. <laughs> I not only have this beautiful dream ring, but I am engaged to my dream man that loves the Lord with all of his heart, lives his life for the Lord, and loves me and adores me and cherishes me, treats me like an absolute queen, is so generous, so kind, so romantic. He has such a big heart. He's so gentle. He's a big guy. He's like my gentle giant, I like to call him. <laughs> He's like a big teddy bear. So I just feel so blessed just to have a man like that in my life. And I get to marry a man like that. It's just such a blessing. So yeah, that's a huge thing. We've been touring beautiful venues. We got engaged August 3rd. And everyone, everyone, everyone is asking, do you have a date? Have you set a date yet? <laughs> Not quite yet, but we're looking. We've looked at venues in St. Augustine and Amelia Island. My thing is that I really want a beautiful old-fashioned chapel. Like, beautiful vaulted ceilings, huge windows, stained glass windows. I want it so beautiful. And most of those aren't really around now at least in my area, or you have to be a member, of course, and the church that we are members of, they don't have, like, a pretty building like that, but we are praying, and we are looking and searching. Lots of planning, lots of things to do as far as setting a date and planning the whole wedding, so I'm going to be taking you guys along for that journey. I'm so excited. Yeah, that's that's a huge update. Most of you probably know that I pretty much uprooted my life and moved across the country from my home state of Michigan to Florida and then navigating that emotionally challenging time where I was really homesick and my grandma had just gone in the hospital. I had just started a new job. Looking back now, I'm just, I'm just so happy to be out on the other side of that. There was so much going on in my life that just felt like it was just hit after hit after hit after hit. And uh, like I couldn't understand it. But I really tried just to work my way through it. I made some commitments. I made some changes. I really just grew my relationship with the Lord and just sought Him throughout all of those issues. And I am so dang thankful that I worked through a lot of them and came through on the other side. Thank the good Lord. I truly cannot imagine my life any different. I love Florida. I love the amazing friends that I've made. I have a, a fiance now and none of this would have happened if I wouldn't have moved. The past few months I have, you know, made some shorts and like YouTube shorts and done short form videos, but I really kind of gotten away from doing long form videos. But I knew that I did want to get back into long form videos. YouTube has always been such a presence in my life and it's so fun. It's brought me so much joy and I love YouTube and I'll never not be doing YouTube. But for the past few months, I have just been doing short form. I'm getting back into long form and I knew that once this engagement happened, I knew that this was something that I wanted to share with you guys. I've shared so much of my life on YouTube and the internet in the past few years. Like, what? 10 12 years which is insane and so life moments like big life moments like this like engagements and moons like i absolutely knew that i wanted to document this and share it you guys are like my friends my best friends i've created so many friendships and relationships from just having this channel and sharing my life online for so long so I knew that I had to come back and just share this exciting announcement with you guys. We are going on vacation to celebrate our engagement. I'm calling it our engagement moon. And I don't even know if that's a really thing. Like I know there's honeymoons and baby moons, but is engagement moon a thing? I don't know, but I'm making it one. <laughs> we are headed out on a trip and I'm so excited for that. So I'm definitely gonna be bringing along my vlog camera and getting little moments of that. I'm just so excited. This season of life is 
so joyful and it's just such a blessing and it's just so so sweet so i did of course announce my engagement like two days after like a day or two after it happened on instagram that's where i'm most active if you haven't followed me on there then follow me on instagram i had a place a question box on there and did like a little q a and i thought it would be fun to answer those questions in this video too so let's grab my phone and we're gonna answer some of these questions and i'll share them with y'all going through all of these again and just like bringing me back all the feels and i just have to say thank you for all the calls the text messages the dms all the messages from everybody but the congratulations it means so much to me it's so appreciated and i'm just so thankful that i have a team of people behind me that are so eager and excited for this season of life in the same way that i am first question is how did y'all meet we met through my best friend kayla shout out to you girlfriend so we uh, all go to the same church but we're in different church groups i hope that makes sense our church is huge and they have different church groups throughout the entire city so same church different church groups because we live like 45 minutes away from one another so Kayla and I are always doing things together, different events, functions, things like that. Well, Brandon Lake was coming into town and we all talked about going as a group. We bought our tickets back in January, I think. And then we all met up when he was here in town for the concert, had a blast. Uh, we all carpooled together and so I met him for the first time by hopping into his truck with everybody and I swear like there was just something about him I had so much peace about him we had such a fun night I think later on that night he added me on Instagram and we just started talking and we never stopped talking it was just one of those things where it started off as a friendship and talking and conversating and then oh my gosh I have so much in common with you and oh my gosh we have so much similarities and interests one day he asked to hang out and then we had so much fun it was like a whole day of non-stop doing things that we both loved so fun had a blast with him and i think it was like two days after that he asked me on a first date and uh, which was later on that week and it was the most fun-filled romantic day of my life like this this man is so romantic and just so top-notch and we just, we've just, we've never stopped. And now here we are. <laughs> okay, this one's going to get me in the feels. Um, I first met you going through a tough part in your life. So glad to see you living your best life. You guys, I am so beyond thankful for this sweet, sweet season of my life with such an amazing Christian, romantic, and gentle, generous man. I'm telling you, I don't... I've never met somebody that is such a good fit for me in so many ways that I thought I like wanted but also needed plus more it's like top notch it's just I'm thankful I'm just I'm so thankful did you know he was asking okay so this man gives himself away because he gets so so excited like he can't keep a secret it's written all over his face he wears his feelings on his sleeve and i knew something was different that day i knew he, i knew he had asked my dad for his blessing and he gave me a time frame of when he was going to ask but i didn't know the day until that day and go if you haven't seen it already i made a video all about this like is he proposing or is he just doing this is he proposing or is he just doing this and i post it on tiktok and instagram i'm gonna post that reel on shorts as soon as i get this video up here on youtube but it's so good and you can see kind of how the whole day went and how everything unwinded and it's so good definitely go watch that video if you haven't already can I take you out on a date soon that ends with us dancing on the beach? Yeah, that's my fiance. And it's pretty much how it all started. <laughs> so lots of changes, lots of updates, but I can tell just sitting in front of this camera right now, I'm just so excited to get back into long form YouTube videos. And there's so much I want to film and update and share with you guys. And I finally just feel like I have more to share and like more to film you know i'm just so excited i feel creative again i feel inspired again and motivated again and i'm so excited just to share these beautiful fun moments with you guys and thank you so so much for being a part of this and joining along i am just so excited to see what, her, what the future holds and what god's plan is moving forward for my life 
And I just want to encourage you too, if you're in a season of your life that I found myself in a few years ago, which is like a lot of changes and challenges, I just want to encourage you to press and seek the Lord, pray, write down a list of your goals and things that you want to accomplish and where you see yourself and where you want to be maybe in six months or a year, two years or in three years. A lot can happen, a lot can change. I promise you that the Lord is always with you. Do not stop seeking the Lord and do not stop having faith. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please let me know what videos you want me to film next. Leave me some comments. I love catching up with you guys there and chatting with you there. And of course, follow me on my socials. I have all the links down below. So I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in a new video very soon.